Hey, hey, what's up y'all? It's your girl Sana Amara and welcome back to my channel. So today I am going to do one of my favorite things to do, which is an unboxing video. It's one of my favorite things. <laughs> so yes, today I'm going to do an unboxing video and I'm really excited about it because it's something that I've been wanting. It's always something that I've been wanting. <laughs> It is an off-white bag. Now, before Virgil Abloh's passing, he's the creator of Off-White, and he was the creative director for Louis Vuitton Men's. So before he passed, I had been wanting to get this bag, but I, I kept putting it off. And then once he passed, I was like, okay, you know what? Let me get this bag because I don't want resellers to get it. And then I have to spend an astronomical price on it because they're money hungry. So yes, I bit the bullet and I got this bag and I'm really excited about it because it would keep popping up on my Instagram because you know, brother Instagram, what? got me again i would constantly see this bag pop up on my instagram feed so once virgil passed i was like okay you know what let me just get it now because i'm gonna regret it if it ends up selling out and they resell it for a crazy amount so let's dig into this box to see what i got So it comes in a box like this, it says bag box, when Off-White was founded, and it says Off-White, Virgil Abloh, defining the gray area between black and white as the color Off-White. And it has the official bag box on it. But yeah, if you follow me on Instagram, I have a video of me um, unboxing a pair of sunglasses that I got of his. So go ahead and check that out. Um, but yeah, let's let's dig into this box. For paper, for branding, I live for branding. So it comes with a felt like this. And here is the bag. So I got the braided Jitney. She is heavy, she is no joke. I'm obsessed, it's so fun. Now with a lot of Virgil Abloh's pieces, like with his fashion shows, like especially for like Louis Vuitton, he's very centered around like childhood and being very like youthful and fun so when i saw this like it reminded me of those like friendship bracelets that we used to make back in camp days that's like literally what this reminded me of and just like all the colors like it's perfect it has green it has yellow white blue pink i love it so i can wear it with basically anything but i'm obsessed like it's so cool and it's a magnetic closure and the fact that i'm playing with it like this and it's not the magnet isn't opening it's fantastic this is how it looks on the inside Ooh. 
a care label. This is so cool. Hang on to that. And then, of course, it comes with a strap. Majority of my bags do come with straps. I need a shoulder or a crossbody strap where I, I don't want to carry it. There we go. Okay, let's see how does this work? I'm very conf confused. I need to look this up because I don't know how this works. Give me a second. One hour later. Okay, so it looks like, huh, I wonder if I put it through these. I bet that's what I do because there's no like, there's no D-rings or anything. So I bet I put it through the arms here because on Saks Off Fifth, that's actually where I got this. Did I get it off Saks Off Fifth or did I just get it from Saks? I don't know. Anyways, in this picture, it looks like it's like not hooked on to anything. So I'm assuming is that the straps go through the handlebars here the two silver part, the two silver thingies. Cause like even on here, it doesn't look like it's hooked to anything. So we're gonna try that and see how this goes. Two hours later. And there's literally nobody on YouTube with this bag. <laughs> Cause I wanted to see how I do it. I honestly feel like it's supposed to go through here because there are no other hooks on this bag. Okay, I got this side through. I don't know how I'm gonna get this side through because it's got these little, oh, oh, maybe you know what? Maybe I don't put that through. Oh yeah, it's easy because there's some straps that have this weird little mechanism on it. It is so hard to get on and off. Ooh. Look, if this ain't it, it's going to be it. Okay. <laughs> Yay. Cool. So this is how it looks on. Super cute. The magnet feels pretty substantial. Like it's not moving, even when I do that. Cause the bag is already heavy itself. So yeah, I am so excited. I cannot wait to style this freaking bag. I cannot wait. Yes! It looks like as a shoulder bag. And then here's how it looks as a crossbody. I'm obsessed, y'all. I love this. It's so fun. It's unique. It's different. I love stuff that is unique and different. And this is that. <laughs> if you guys enjoyed this video, please make sure to give it a thumbs up. Please make sure to comment and subscribe. Let me know if you guys have a jitney yourself. How did you connect the strap? I was looking at a YouTube video. She had the girl I was looking at, she had like a leather one and it had like little loops on the inside. This didn't have that. So I had to uh, make up my own thing and just put it through the handles. So hopefully I did the right thing. If you have a Jitney, let me know which one you have in the comments below. Please make sure to follow me on all my social media at Honest Samara and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.